Ladies and gentlemen, presenting to you Vani Ganapati. <laughs> Vani Ganapati began her dance training in Bharatanatyam at the tender age of four. Since then, she has performed all over the world and is one of the country's most popular dancers. Trained by the legendary guru of our times, Guru Kalyan Sundaram, Vani today takes his legacy forward by teaching and training young aspirants of Bharatanatyam at her school in Bangalore, Sanchari. She says that Bharatanatyam training requires tremendous dedication and discipline. She says the greatest wonder of life is the spirit of dance. A devotee of Baba, Vani Ganapati will be offering a prayer in movement today to celebrate Baba's 100 years of Mahasamadhi. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Vani Ganapati. Namaskar. <clears throat> what a wonderful occasion. Baba's 100th Mahasamadhi year. And what a cause. Education of the rape survivor girl children. I'm indeed privileged to dance for such an occasion. At the very beginning, I would like to thank the Sai Bisa Trust and the Sai Bisa family headed by Jayavahi. Thank you for this opportunity to perform for Sai. What does Sai mean to all of us? Pure love. And what better way of showing love in the various manifestations, starting with Vatsalya, the mother-child relationship. Who better than little Krishna and Yashoda? Yashoda is trying her best to cajole Krishna to eat, to sleep, but he is adamant on wanting that moon. She says, how is it possible, Krishna? But she thinks of a plan. She pours water into a bowl and thinks that the reflection will satisfy Krishna. But Krishna is no ordinary child. He doesn't get fooled. He is very angry with his mother. And Yashoda says, how can I satisfy this child? When he cries, my heart bleeds. She suddenly notices that the moon is nowhere. The clouds have closed the moon. She tells Krishna, that moon will come back tomorrow, but till then, you promise to sleep just a little. While she's putting Krishna to sleep, he jumps out of the cradle, and she is so frustrated, she ties his hand and, hands and feet. And at that time, the saint poet of Karnataka, Purandara Dasa, himself enters. He hears the crying of a child, and he immediately looks around and sees Krishna. He says, how can anybody tie these feet, hands and feet? She says, he says, this is the child who has given salvation, moksha, to none other than Mahabali when he took the form of Vamana, the dwarf, and asked for three foot measures of soil. She suppresses, Vishnu suppresses the arrogance of Mahabali when he comes in the form of a dwarf. This Krishna is 
the Parama Purusha. He is Matsya Kurma Varaha Narasimha, Vamana, Parashurama, Sri Rama, Balarama, Krishna and Kalki. Purandara tells Yashoda, come and hug him, come and play with him. He is not an ordinary child, he is a gem among children. Vatsalya.
Krishna
ಉದ್ಘಾಟಿಸಿದಳು ಶೋದ ಮಗುಗಳ ಮಣಿಕ ಶೋದ 
ಸಿದ್ಧಳು 